So, Blaze, what do you want to do today? If I'm going to be brutally honest, I don't know. Me either. That's why I asked. <sighs> Guess we'll just watch some TV. Again? Got any better ideas? <sighs> no. I'll go get the remote. <sighs> Let's see what Netflix has. Hey, Mom. Hey, Dad. Oh, hey, Charmy. Is something wrong? What? No, no, nothing's wrong. We're just a little tired, that's all. Are you sure? You both seem kind of sad. <sighs> all right. You might want to sit down for this. Uh, uh, okay. See, Charmy? We're not happy. What? What do you mean you're not happy? What, what does that mean? It's hard to explain, Charmy. What we mean by not happy is, is that it's not that we're not happy together. Trust me, no, that's not what it means at all. It's just that, well, me and your mother have been married for a little while now, and both, and both me and her have agreed that we haven't really had any, well, alone time together. What are you saying? You don't want to be around me? Am I too close? Am I too clinging to you guys? No, 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 Charmy, that's not at all what we meant. It's just that, well, even though me and your father are married, we just haven't really had any time to spend just for the two of us, you know? Especially since the fact that we got, well, Vector and Espio here, and there's, you know, pretty much, you know, five of us in this house. Me and your mother just never had any time alone, you know? Just the two of us in the house, you know what I mean? Oh, I get it. Don't be sad, Charmy. It's not because we don't want to be around you. No, no, I get it. I understand. It's not because of that reason. You do just, you know, want some quality time together. I, I understand. All right, well, uh, uh, good. Nice telling me. Uh, bye. Well, that went well. Back to Nef Netflix. <sighs> Back to Netflix. Meanwhile... That was awesome. Oh, such a goaded game. Why can't we be in this game? Because we would be irrelevant to the plot. <laughs> Whatever. We're just too good for this game. That's what it is. Keep telling yourself that. Guys! Oh, hey, what's up, Charmy? Wanna play Sonic Frontiers? There's no time for that. <laughs> hey, come on. That's my only controller. I already had to tape one Joy-Con. I don't want to have to tape another one. Maybe you wouldn't have to tape any of them if you would just control your anger. Hey, come on! Can you blame me? This game right here gives me anger issues. The players online are so toxic. Who cares about all of them? I'm in a crisis right now. A crisis? What kind of crisis? My parents aren't happy. What do you mean they're not happy? Well, what I mean is that I went to go talk to them, and they just seemed kind of, you know, sad. And they told me they weren't happy because they haven't been able to spend time together or something. Oh, that's just weird. I mean, now they get to spend time together all, all the time, don't they? Not really, since there's about five of us in this house. You and me included, and Charmy and both of them. Indicating, considering the fact that, well, you know... Since five of us live here and we never really usually leave this house, they never get to spend time together. Wow, you just sound like a really big nerd just then. Indications? You shouldn't even finish your sentence. You messed up your words. Shut up. Look, I just don't know what to do. I want to help them, but I don't know what to do exactly. Hmm, <clears throat> well, here's an idea. Why not make them go on a honeymoon? I want to... Oh, see, a honeymoon is when, well, two people who really like each other get to spend a lot of quality time together, just the two of them, you know, and maybe they might even... Okay, I don't think you need to explain more. He's six. Hmm, that's a good idea. Throw them a honeymoon, and then they'll be able to spend more time together. I like that. 
But, uh, how do we do one of those? I mean, first of all, we would have to plan the whole thing. Second of all, we would have to get them out of the house to, you know, plan it. And then, well, I don't know anything about honeymoons, so I don't know what to do. Hey, trust us, kid. We can take care of almost all of that. Wait, really? Yeah, we could get them out of the house. And then while that's happening, you plan it, and then we'll stall until you're done, bring them back here, and then they can have good, good time. Or something like that. Oh, that sounds like a great idea. Why didn't I think of that? Because you're six, and six-year-olds usually don't know what honeymoons are. Fair enough. All right, you two, get my parents out of the house while I take care of the rest. Yes, sir. All right, come on, let's go. <sighs> I can't believe I'm actually doing this. Ah! All right, it's planning time. But I don't know what honeymoons are and what people do on them. Oh, well, I guess I'll just have to figure it out on my own. Anything? Nope. On my mark, we're going to jump them. What? Why do we have to jump them? Shh. Trust me. Uh, um, Silver? Silver? What? What? what, what what's going on? Get him! Whoa! Uh, whoa, how, how did you just make him go to sleep? Did you kill him? No, I just knocked him out. Oh. I'm embarrassed. Vector, what's going on? <sighs> Sorry. Nah, nothing personal. Espio, knock her out one of your blow darts. Blow what? Apologies, princess. <laughs> uh, uh. Sleepy night-night. All right, now uh, we gotta load them up into the car before they wake up! But wait, this is a honeymoon. Shouldn't they have stuff packed or something? This is their house. Does it matter? Kind of. Fair enough. Oh, okay, I packed them junk. Now quickly, let's go! Go! Get him in the backseat. Oh. Okay, okay, we got him in the backseat. Are, are, are they good? From what I can tell, yes. Okay, then, come on, let's go. All right, so, Vector and SGL got my parents out of the house. So now I just need to figure out what to do on a honeymoon and, well, what kind of plans for it. I need to figure out what kind of things someone would do on a honeymoon. Well, I guess I'll have to search it up on Google. Nothing. <sighs> well, guess I'll have to figure it out on my own. Hmm. But what kind of things? Hmm. 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 I feel dizzy. What was I thinking about again? Right, honeymoon th stuff. Alright, well, um... Back massages! That's a thing, right? For honeymoons? Back massages? Yeah, that's a thing. Alright, um, back massages. That's, gonna be, that's something. And, uh... Let me think. Uh... I figured out the rest. I'll call them. No, 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 no. Charming, come on. You have to think of more than that. Can't be lazy. This is for your parents now. <sighs> hmm. Dinner! That's good. Back massages and dinners. And maybe Vector and Espio can help me out with other stuff. Yeah, that's good. That's good. That's good. All right. I'm going to call them. Back in the car. Espio, how are they holding up back there? Still knocked unconscious. All right, well, that's good. We just gotta make sure they stay like that until Charmy gives us the call. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Hold on. I think I'm getting something. Oh. Ow. Oh, what happened? Oh, Vector, Espio, what in the name of chaos are you doing? 
I'm so sorry, but we had to get you out of the house for something. It's important. How is kidnapping us important? Oh, good news. Charmy's done. We can go back to the house. Done? Done with what? It's a surprise. All right, come on. Back to the house. Back inside the house. Oh, all right. We're back at the house. Vector, you better have a very good reason why I shouldn't smite you right now. Oh, but, but because look, 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 look. Look at what? <gasps> the bed is made? There's ocean stuff playing on our TV. But Sonic? What's up, guys? Charmy, what is all this? He... <laughs> Ow. Well, guys, I remember you, you know, saying you weren't happy or anything because you wanted to spend some, you know, personal time together. So I set up a whole day for you two. Well, technically a few hours because, well, what I planned was kind of short. <laughs> but uh, I planned, well, I planned for you back massages, a dinner, and then finally private time for you two. Like a little honeymoon. Aw, Charmy, that's so sweet. So is this what you kidnapped us for? Oh, yeah. Telling us would have uh, been a lot more easier than it wouldn't be a surprise. So, too excited? Actually, yes. This is nice. Are you excited, Silver? Absolutely. This is exactly what we needed. Cool. All right, so then, first things first, let's do a back massage. Hosted by yours truly. You could do back massages, Sonic? Heck yeah, I can do back massages. Some say I give the best back massages in town. All right, who's first? Who's first? Unless you want me to do both of you at the same time. What? No way, you can't do that. Wanna bet? Ah! Whoa! Mmm, soothing, isn't it? Actually, yeah, this is kind of relaxing. You do give pretty good back reps, huh? Oh, this is just a tiny bit of my back rubbing skills. Wait till you see full power. Ooh, hot diggity dog. That felt great. Your turn, Blaze. Oh, ooh. Oh, that felt great. Uh, tell me about it. Did you hear my bone snap? Yeah. Hmm. So. I join it. This is great. This is amazing. I feel like I'm dreaming. Good to know. Now I think it's a little bit time for a neck massage. Oh, yeah. Oh, that's nice. Oh, that's good. And done. So, can I give a good back massage or what? I'll give you this one. They were the best I've ever had. Good to know. All right, well, you two enjoy the rest of your doing things, whatever it's called. Honey, man. Whatever. Ooh, I feel great, Blaze. How do you feel? I feel great, Silver. Oh, oh, best I've felt in years. We've got to get Sonic to give us more back massages every now and then. Agreed. So, what's next on this little honeymoon, Charmy? <laughs> Dinner! All right, boys. What do we got for my parents to eat? Well, considering the fact that neither me or Espio or you have cooking experience, I thought I'd go with something very simple. Cheops. Perfect, I guess. All right, I'll pour a bowl for each of them. All right, perfect. Two bowls of Lay's chips. I shall go serve them now. Here. Can you believe Charmy is serving us dinner? I can't believe it either. But he doesn't know how to cook. What's he gonna give us? 
All right, Mom and Dad, I have your dinner ready. Technically, it's more of a snack, but nah, what the heck. Here's your bowl of Lay's chips. Thank you. And here's your bowl of Lay's chips. Why, thank you. And for this occasion, too, I have a movie for you guys. Happy birthday! Oh, a Christmas movie. Thanks, Charmy. No problem. Well, enjoy your dinner snack, and uh, let me know when you're done. I'm enjoying this so far, Silver. What, the movie? No, us spending time together. It's exactly what we needed. Yeah, so thoughtful and charming. Shows how really much he cares about us, huh? Best son ever. Well, let's dig in then. A few minutes later. Mmm, that was pretty good. Even if it was just chips. Agreed. Hey guys, I see you're done with your food, huh? Yep. Cool. Well, I'll just be taking these. Thanks for the dinner snack, Charmy. <laughs> so, um, what's next on this little honeymoon thing of yours? Well, it's the final part. The final. The final layer of the cake. The, um, the final horizon. The, the end. The, 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 the final thing. What would that be? It's time for you to finally have some alone time. Alone time? You mean just the two of us in the room? Yep. Just uh, both of you all to yourselves. Do whatever you want. I don't really know what you're going to do, but, well, it's your time. Spend it wisely. Oh, I'm excited, aren't you? Yeah. Thanks, Charmy. Ah, oh, you're welcome. <laughs> it was no big deal. Ah, oh, but it was. Even though we said it was fine and you didn't need to worry, you still planned this whole day out for us because, well, you care about our happiness. It really shows how much you really care about us, huh? Well, yeah, of course. You're my parents. I love you more than anything. Oh, and we love you too, Charmy. Thank you, son, for everything. <laughs> You're welcome, guys. So, I'm gonna go ahead and go now. Bye-bye. Bye. All right, come on, guys. Let's go. Oh, yeah, yeah, right, right. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Oh, wait, guys. Before I go, I gotta play the the music. The music. Oh, the music. <laughs> All right, I just said it. It should go. Off. It should start playing in a few minutes. Come on. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Wow, Silver. I can't believe our son playing this whole little honeymoon just for us. Me either. He's an awesome son. So now that we're alone. Well, what do we do? Hmm, I'm not sure. I haven't really thought this through. But what is that? Thought you could use it, just in case. Um, okay. Hmm, is it weird or am I getting like kind of weird vibes right now? Why is that? Because when I look at you, it's just, uh, you're just so pretty. Oh, <laughs> uh, thanks, Oliver. I could say the same for you. Yeah. Uh, oh, is it hot here? Is it hot in here? Is it just me? Oh. Hmm, Silver. Y yeah. Well, we are alone, aren't we? Um, yeah. So now we can do things we've always wanted to do while we were alone. Oh. <clears throat> well, <laughs> what did you have in mind? I think you know. Mm. Uh, uh, mm. Mm. Mission accomplished, boys. Yeah. Honeymoon ever, huh? Absolutely. 